the way I move. First you slide, then you boom. That's a couple going on you. Oh, yeah, watch the way I move. Oh, ah, watch the way I move. Oh, ah, watch the way I move. First you slide, then you boom. That's a couple going on you. Yo, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. It is October 30th, literally one day before Halloween, and I wanted to make a gameplay with something very Halloween-ish and very new-ish. So this happened to be a combination of both. It's a very new game to me because I never played it. It's also in beta, so that makes it very new to the platform, and it's Halloween-themed. And the name is actually called The House Tower Defense. So it says here, the game is currently in beta. Lots more content and features to come. It's a tower defense style haunted mansion of mystery. Evil lurks within. Take the elevator and rid the house of evil one floor at a time. How high can you go? You'll need a team. Open up the tomb or urns to earn heroes to battle with and face your fears team up with friends if you need some help and conquer the house so this is just literally chapter one so far of this game there is more content and more updates to come i'm very excited for this brand new journey i'm about to venture on if you guys want to take the journey with me be sure to smash the like button on this video and subscribe if you guys are new here watching for the very first time there's also some codes right here, right in the game's description. House 3K will get you guys 100 free souls. And Boom 10K will get you guys 200 free souls. So that's a total of 300 free souls. That'll help you guys start your journey out in the game. So let's get into it. Alright, so we had some technical difficulties with the last server but now that you guys can see my screen is fully loaded in it is now directing me to the summoning crypt where we're going to summon souls or fighters characters heroes what do we call these things that we're equipping because they're not pets you feel me they're monsters and stuff like that i saw literally a butcher pig <laughs> how are you a butcher and a pig you're literally the, th the 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 thing that we would get from the butcher you know what i'm saying so you took the butcher out and stole his job basically <laughs> it's kind of funny all right so it says here welcome to the house a tower defense game here are some free souls head to the tomb and summon your first hero Okay, so we're calling them heroes, and they gave us 50 souls for free, so that's really cool. You can also earn heroes by opening up premium urns. So premium obviously ties into you guys having a Roblox membership. Go to the tomb and get a hero. Okay, so day one, we got our 50 right there. So now we have a total of 100, so that's cool. And then on day seven, it seems like they give you a premium urn for free. So seven days of logging into this game, playing it, leveling up, it's going to help. Okay. All right. So here we go. All right. Let's see. Now can we interact with these guys? Oh, nice. Okay. It says claim your gift. Oh, we got a free unit. The paranormal detective. Okay. And then what about this guy? Let's talk to him. Scully. Welcome to the house. I'm Skelly. I'll help you out as much as I can. Battle your way through each floor to reach to the top. It gets harder the higher you go up, but first visit the tomb. Okay. Appreciate your time there, Skelly. Alright, excuse me, sir. Do you say the same thing? Thanks for playing the beta. Here's a uh, free spike pet. Just interact with him to claim. Remember to report bugs or suggestions in the official social channels linked under the game's page. So just in case you guys are wondering, they do have a Discord server for the game itself. And they also have a Twitter account where they post, um, you know, the update for the game. You know, as far as like releasing trailers or releasing any type of information. So it's very crucial that you follow the Twitter and then also join the Discord server. All right, so let's claim the dog. 
because this is what I was trying to do in the last server <laughs> and um, I wasn't able to get him so spike welcome aboard sir okay how do we uh, how do we spawn in spike does he actually do anything or he's just there for company <laughs> alright so let's go to backpack real quick okay so here's the backpack okay here's the slot for the pets let's go ahead and equip spike we have collectibles here we have urns then we have heroes so let's see what does he do all right let's view him okay so this is awesome i know a lot of players are probably like yo i wish he would get into the game already but listen this is my first time around i gotta poke around and you know find out everything that i need to know and then of course as a brand new player there's going to be other new players that need direction they need guiding so this is why i make these types of videos okay so let's see his stats here so here's his damage it's ranging from 20 all the way up to 130 and his range is from between 20 to 30 and his attack speed is at 0.5 so he's kind of slow okay it says info this paranormal detective comes alive when inside the house searching for clues to the mysteries the mysteries excuse me of the paranormal okay and here's his like uh, hero lore basically like his background I believe this paranormal detective has always been intrigued by the mysterious uh, the, the, yeah the mysterious as a kid he would visit haunted houses all around the world plus 10% damage versus ghosts okay so he's good um, facing off against ghosts so that's good to know here and he's also an epic rarity that's dope and then you have the robux shop all right here as well there's a vip pack limited heroes pack premium urns and then you can instantly buy souls as well so if i wanted to buy more souls i would need 50 robux that's the cheapest and then you have fifty thousand for the most expensive wow that's a lot of robux spent there's also a global active boost right now 1.5 times the soul gems for like three and a half more hours pretty cool all right we got some claimables here okay it says playtime gifts earn free gifts just for playing sweet that's pretty dope all right let's see what else we got here so here's the codes so we can go ahead and put them here so let's put uh boom 10k there we go i kind of forgot the other one <laughs> <laughs> I kind of forgot what the other code was, but if you guys want to restart the video, I kind of, you know, set it in the beginning. So I hope that credits for something. We have settings here. So just in case you guys are on low end devices, here's some adjustments that you can make. Um, yeah, that's pretty cool. Particles and everything like that. You can turn that off the animations. You can turn off seeing other people's pets. And then you have your daily login rewards calendar in which we claimed already. So now let's go ahead and start summoning things. I love this lobby area, bro. It's so dope. So we got to go down here, right? Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me, bro. It was so dark. <laughs> Look at Spike. He's just floating on the stairs. He just does what he wants. <laughs> Yo, look at this the realms who are you sir why are you blocking the realms the mortimer oh he's like the mortician guy okay we got scully again does he say anything in here mortimer stands at the guardian between the living and the dead he was once a noble warrior in his mortal life but was chosen to ensure the balance of souls is maintained he guards the entrance and exit to the realms coming soon Scully knows a lot, bro. I love it. Okay, we got another one over here. Okay, you can earn these urns just by playing and winning. Every win is a 10% chance to get a random premium urn. Okay, premium urns contain five different heroes to collect. You can purchase them by interacting with them. Shiny chances. Every urn has a boosted shiny chance at a 1 in 25% chance of getting. Okay. Okay, who's this over here? Is this a player? 
why is she standing here looking at the darkness? <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and start summoning some uh, some heroes here. So this first one is going to cost us 50 souls. We got 310 as a total. We could summon 1 or we could summon 10. In order for you to summon 10, you need the actual amount. So let's go ahead and single summon here. Hopefully we get a legendary. Okay, so starting off, we got a rare, we got a samurai. Okay, cool. It also tells you at the bottom right hand corner of your screen what you just obtained. That was interesting. So the secret is the hardest one to get. Heroes shown are boosted chances and change randomly each hour. Oh, okay, so it's a cycle. So it's not gonna be the same grouping of heroes. It's gonna be a different one every hour. Okay, so here are the rate percentages. Rare, 78%, 15% for epics, 5% for legendary, 1% for mystic, and 0.25% for a secret. We got the containment guy. He's in a hazmat suit. <laughs> okay, so that was the rare. I love how it's actually opening up to. We got a demon priest. Okay, cool. We got SWAT. Send in the SWAT. Oh, I love the I love the blue color instead of a black color. That's interesting. Okay, we got one more opening. I just noticed how I got some characters that is not, um, that's not shown on this uh, picture. We got the Plague Doctor, so we got ourselves another epic. That's good. Oh, look at this guy. He has a lot of potions equipped. Okay, so now we could go ahead and exit. So this is, I guess, my current team setup. And if I wanted to change my setup, all I have to do is go into my backpack, go to my heroes, and then equip the, you know, the ones that I want to equip. I'm assuming that they automatically equip your best because I don't see a equip best button. But if I had to assume, like I said, they would um, basically equip your best depending on the rarity. So we do have two epics and we do have a couple of rares. So that's good. All right, I think we're ready to start. All right, so let's exit out of this tomb crypt. Oh my God, someone literally is dressed as Freddy Fazbear. They're trying to give me a heart attack. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm old. You got to relax, bro, with the outfits. All right. So it says over here, Demon Slayer. What is this? What's over here? I don't think we're allowed to open this. Oh, it's coming soon. Okay, okay. Okay. There's a ladder here. Should we go up this ladder? Oh, we can go up the ladder. How cool is that? Is there any secrets up here? It's a library. I'm just checking everything out. Okay, it's nothing. <laughs> it's nothing. Endless, the garden. What is this? What's out here? Okay, Skelly. Welcome to the gardens. This is endless mode. You get new rewards every 10 waves you defeat. Rewards go up to 100, but you can go on as long as possible. Boom Bear is the secret hero reward for those brave enough to reach wave 100. Good luck. Oh, yeah, I kind of don't want to do an endless mode because I'm just starting out and I don't think I can go endless. <laughs> All right, we got AFK zone. I guess you can earn something for, you know, being AFK. And what is this? Okay, that's also coming soon as well. Another Scully. The ultimate trophy. Earn a boss head by completing the room on level 50. Okay. Uh, yeah, actually, me, I, I, don't, I mean, I don't really care. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I guess you can join. It's it's, it's fine. <laughs> it's 
So one thing about tower defense games is you got to learn to properly place your units. So if you placing down like like healers and and you know money people that don't really deal damage, you're basically going to lose. Okay, so we got to choose a floor here. <laughs> I mean, I really don't care. Okay, so we got the nasty noob as the floor boss. Okay, I guess we'll just go with floor one. Difficulty level. Is this a one player thing? Because I've seen both of us come in here. Okay, here we go, here we go. Whoa, can I just take some time to admire the decor of the elevator? <laughs> oh, this is so crazy cool, bro. Okay. So the game could automatically start or you can just, you know, basically start it if you're in a rush. So here's the entrance. So this is where they're coming out at and where are they trying to get? So this is the exit right here. So we got to stop them from getting there. Okay, so right now we don't have any money. I can't place any units down though. Yeah, I cannot place any units down. Okay. Well, this is a learning curve anyway, so this is our first day. Let's just see what happens. Do we attack with like spike or something? Spike. Okay, so you can click on the mobs and see what they do. I was clicking on him. No, I'm gonna lose my first. Oh, okay, no. Go, go. Oh, okay. Shoot him, shoot him. <laughs> it was so weird. How did they make you start the game like that? And then you're supposed to upgrade your mobs as well. Okay. So, um. Okay, we can upgrade him. And we can upgrade. Okay. So we can't do two upgrades. Oh, there's a ghost. This is your specialty. Please take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Oh, man. Ah, oh, you suck. <laughs> you're supposed to be specializing in defeating the ghost, bro. And he sucks. Okay, um, let's see. I don't know. I don't know what's the difference with all of these units here, but I'm gonna just place down as you know a couple here by this end because we need to take them out. Yeah, he's not defeating the ghosts at all. We're gonna lose. <laughs> We're defeating the zombie noobs. Oh, I saw that little. Oh, okay. I like that little katana slash that he's doing. Oh, there's a giant guy. That's not good. That is not good at all. Oh, look at the hat. Look at the containment guy. Okay. So we're going to lose this first wave, but that's a part of, you know, the learning curve, as I said. And there's the boss. So we did some pretty good damage. All right. Can we upgrade the samurai? There we go. Okay, we got some really gigantic guys coming in. Can we upgrade you? Okay, good. Oh lord. He's gonna he's gonna take away so much of my health. Yeah. Game over. <laughs> okay, the containment guy, he got some he got some souls. Yes. Okay. Good work, guys. Good work. Okay, these ghosts are coming in a little bit too fast. So like I said, you know, you want to properly place down your containment units. And, um, yeah. <laughs> so we survived uh, seven out of the eight waves, which was pretty good. But like I said, you know, when it comes down to tower defense games, you really, really got to know how to place down your units. You got to know who to upgrade and who is more important to upgrade. So we had some pretty good, solid, um, you know, 
guys out here on the line taking as much damage as physically possible so that was kind of cool um the containment guy he had this little like vacuum that he was using as a suckage and it wasn't really doing much so i would say maybe don't use him or maybe try to upgrade him as fast as possible but samurai dude was pretty cool the plague doctor was really cool as well and i did not get to use any of my other units so i am definitely going to go back out there i definitely need another round um i would probably say team up with somebody that's really good if it's your first day like it's my first day but you know that was a pretty good solid run i was not expecting to survive that long so that's cool <clears throat> Okay, so did we earn anything? I think we might have enough for one more summoning. Oh no, it's doing that loading thing. Yeah, nothing is loaded in on the screen. It's doing that again. That's what made me had to uh, leave the server last time. Let's see if a character reset works. Okay, that did nothing. <laughs> that did nothing. I know I wasted a lot of time just chatting and everything like that, but... Okay, so it's allowing me to enter these areas, but I'm trying to go to the summoning crypts down here. Yeah, it's not allowing me to do it. But if you guys have enjoyed the video, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe if you guys are new here watching for the very first time. Once again, this is called The House. It is currently in beta. And um, so far, my first day playing it, I enjoy it. This is one of the, if I may say, this is probably one of the best tower defense games that I've played so far. We played anime tower defense we played other different types of tower defenses in Roblox, but I feel like this one, seeing as it has an actual, you know, a theme related to the month itself, I think this might end up being my favorite, you know, but I'll catch you guys in the next video. If you guys want to see, uh, you know, day two where I grind a little bit more and become a little bit better, <clears throat> excuse me, comment down below. Hey yo, what the fuck? That was totally wicked! Better how I do what I just do. Tryna make my mama proud of me. I hope my mama proud of me. Cause I dubbed college just so I could focus on a dream. I know my mama died of me, salute me, nasty down with me. Now two bros going back and forth, sibling rivalry. Who the side gotta be? Do numbers like the lottery. The coldest every winter, every summer, nothing hot as me. And if I spring up, build my nigga on the side of me. Ready for a war?